Okay, so we've been receiving lots of emails and messages about how to warm up correctly. So what we thought is we'd put together a quick warm up for you. All right, so I'm just gonna take the girls through what I would do with my team just to warm them up before a game or training. And most of my teams, they know the drill. They head to the baseline and it's time to start. Okay, all right girls, so up to the transverse line. Let's just do some jogging. So we want to just get them moving, we want to get them running, we want to get them through those key movement skills like running, skipping, hopping and jumping in the warm up, just to get those bodies ready for training and the game. One more go. Great work. Okay girls, so we're going to go into high knees, please, up and back. We want to minimise the time the foot is on the ground. Don't forget your arms, don't forget your arms. Eyes up and make sure their eyes are up. Now we're going to go reverse from the high knees to the butt kicks. Okay, so again, nice quick feet, eyes up, down the court. Off you go, up and back, don't forget those arms. Great work. Okay, now we're going to go again up to the transverse and just a normal skip, okay? So I call it a kindergarten skip. Everyone starts smiling on this one. Kindergarten skip, okay? So this is a key fundamental movement skill. Okay, it's got the step hop, step hop. Now we want to put some elevation into that skip. So we want to go up nice and high, okay, and a skip jump. So make sure opposite arm to leg. Off you go. Let's get some elevation. Good. Eyes up, chin up, down the court. And again. Great work. Just to add in some of the knee progress, I'm going to get the girls to do some knee hops. Okay, up to the transverse line. Okay, girls, off you go. So really hold that for one, two, and bend those knees. Netballers never bend their knees. Okay, really bend nicely into it and hold it for two. A little bit wider on the way back. So you really want to be doing nearly a, plyo a plyometric movement, so a bit more side to side. And eyes up, make sure your chin eyes are up, down the court, chin up, chin up. Nice work, girls. Okay, now we're just gonna get a, a little bit more movement. So I just want you to run at about 70% now. So a little bit faster, up and back. A nice quick turn. Ready, go. Great work. Okay, we're gonna lunge up to the transverse. Nice and deep, hands on hips, knee to the ground. Sit, girls. Just dynamic stretches just to get the muscles ready for the workout ahead. Now on the way back, girls, we want to go into a nice deep squat, so call it a sumo. Sit. And really, again, encouraging that bend in the knees, nice and deep. Two more um, dynamic stretches. Are we going to go some high kicks, the so opposite arm to foot on the way up? And then on the way back, we're going to do some rocking. So it's all in that back leg stretch. I don't know, some people call these funny names. <laughs> Okay, so really encourage them to bend at the hips, nice deep stretch, and just rocking those arms forward and back. Great work, girls. Now at this point of the warm-up, see it's nice and quick, they're ready for the next progression, which I'd encourage you, I'd go straight into our fast feet drill, which will take about another five minutes. So that will take the warm-up to approximately 10 minutes. Then you get into your footwork and ball work, team drills, court work and everything else you need to do.